My name is Sherry Roman from Roman Agency, Inc. in Austin, Texas. I'm here today to talk to you about insurance, death, and taxes. I know it's kind of a boring subject and morbid too, but like death and taxes, insurance is not going away anytime soon, so you might as well learn something about your own policy. With that said, I'm going to take my policy and explain some of the liability coverages to you. Liability. You know, a lot of people don't even know what that means. Do you know what that means? Liability actually means that if you hit a car and it's your fault and somebody's hurt or the property is damaged, that's the amount that your insurance will pay for your accident. Now, in my particular case, I have bodily injury coverage of $100,000 per person and $300,000 per occurrence. What that means is if I hit somebody in my Honda Accord and they're injured, the most my insurance company will pay for their injuries is $100,000. And the most my insurance company will pay for the whole accident, like if five people are hurt or five kids or whatever, is going to be $300,000. The next section under my liability coverages, as you can see, is property damage. In my case, my insurance company will pay $50,000 for somebody else's property that I damage in an accident. Now, what if I hit a Bentley with my Honda Accord? The Bentley owner is only going to get $50,000. Now, in most cases, $50,000 would be enough to cover property damage. In the case of a Bentley, wouldn't be enough. What are your coverages? You might want to look at your policy and check it out, which takes me to my next point. Uninsured and underinsured motorist coverage. I'm going to talk about that in my next segment. And you might want to look at your own policy and make sure that you have those coverages, just in case somebody runs into you who maybe isn't insured or doesn't have enough insurance to cover your vehicle. Until then, I really appreciate your time. I hope you learned something about liability coverage. And we all know that a lot of crashes occur because people are texting and driving. And I hope the next time you get into your car, you won't do that. Thanks for your time.